has been taken over by the evil Reptilons. Yeah, they look evil. The Reptilons have enslaved the human station there. That's not very nice. They're being forced to create an evil robot army destined to destroy Earth, and they're making them do it in their underpants. <laughs> Your mission, transport all hostages back to your ship, destroy all robots, rid Planet X of the evil reptilons and something else I didn't get a chance to read. So yeah, this is a request by Insert Disc B. So, factory map of Planet X, factory wave, canal maze, bonus wave, okay. Interesting, it gives me a, a, a nice display of where I'm going. And, oh, oh god, there's, oh fuck, there's a load of them, yeah, get away. Run away! Oh god, there's a ton of them here. Okay. I love the... Uh, oh, I can't get up there. I love the um, Atari ST uh, music. I know it's technically inferior to like Amiga music, but there's just something about the sort of style of the... I don't know how to describe it. You know, the um, sort of weird... Uh, you know... The noise. Oh shit, I fell off the edge. Oh my god. Oh, I nearly fell off the edge. That's good. Oh, damn it. Oh, I thought I was just a. Uh, my character wasn't stupid enough to actually walk off, but at least he was clever enough to grab and prevent me from killing him. Whoa. Oh god. Weird scrolling that isn't smooth, but. Oh. I like how the. Uh, the laser noise actually sounds like it's part of the music. It's like, do 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 do. Yeah, that's fun. Oh god. So yeah, obviously the name is a take off, a take on the planet Escape from the Planet of the Apes. But it's like it's a, it's like a fake out. Escape from the Planet of the Robot Monsters. <laughs> uh, now it looks like I have bombs. But I didn't actually. Oh, I, should, I, I don't know if there's any other. I think those are bombs. I don't know how to activate them. I should have read the manual. I, always, I usually read the manual. I just sort of forgot this time. Is there an end to these guys? They just keep coming. Oh god, this red guy is really fast. Hey, look, that there's some homeless guy being forced to build robots. Hey, hey, I walked over him and he. Oh god, did I kill that guy? Was he happy? Oh, blowing up his workstation, and I get points for it. Oh, turn the big switch, and something happened. Evidently, look at these stupid robots all piled up in the corner there. Come on, walk into my huge lasery beam thing. Okay. I guess maybe that stops them being produced, turning off the thing there, so maybe I can progress to the next screen. That staircase or escalator or whatever it is. Don't know what these things are. Oh! Oh, yeah, there. No, it's an escalator. That's good. I do vaguely remember seeing this on uh, Games Master a very long time ago. Oh god, there's a lot of them! Run away! Hey, you there! Stop building robots, just. Put your hands up in the air, be happy, and then and then dis Oh I fell over and died. Run, run. It seems like he moves faster when he's moving upwards rather than I mean not diagonally, you know, straight. Oh. I think I can get caught on these edges here. Stupid robots. Don't even understand obstacles. Hey you there. Why do they make you work in your underwear? I don't understand. Oh! Coming out that door. Shoot them! Kill! You there, stop it! And I'll blow up your workstation. There. Oh, some of them are shooting. Looks like that. It's a robot in a wheelchair. <laughs> oh. Equal opportunity uh, employers, these. Now, I, I definitely have bombs. It says 12 there. I've got to figure out how to use them. So, I'm gonna uh, see if I can. Oh, <laughs> I walked into the wall there. I'm gonna see if I can pause the game and uh, look it up. Sometime later. Ah, there we go. Shift. I had to just. 
I was googling like crazy trying to find I should have looked at it before I really should have but damn it I guess that's to be used when you're surrounded because it seems to be centered on the player um, yeah interrupted the flow a bit there but um, I really should have looked at it before but <laughs> it looked like a oh, simple game alright it's what I can let's use another one bang bang Bang! I mean, it's annoying. I have to reach over and press the joystick, uh, the keyboard. But you know, what are you going to do? I think the Atari had only. I, I noticed that it seems to slow down when I move off the edge of the screen. Anyway, it's a good thing that the uh, enemies are slower than I am. Um. Yeah. Hey, I destroyed some. Hey, it looks like something in. Oh, it is something in there. I grabbed it. Is that a fridge? In there? And is that food in there? Yeah, it's like a. It really does sound like that. That mute, that laser is part of the. Oh, I see. Yeah, That's, um, they're coming out of those things when they're being manufactured, aren't they? Okay, time to boom, bang, bang. That's fun. Yeah, screen shakes. I don't know what these things actually do. Very uh, retro looking robots. It's got a kind of uh, sort of Flash Gordon 60s, sort of, not 60s, uh, I don't know. Was Flash Gordon 60s or 50s? Or, I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, it's got that kind of owl retro feel. Lots of lives. Bang! <laughs> gotta stop. Stop building the robots. Yeah, I'm gonna go up here. Go, oh! See, I have to stop to reach over if I'm going to use the bombs but I'm going to do it now come here <laughs> it's great that these bombs seem to affect only the robots it makes sense if they were some kind of electronic, electromagnetic pulse bombs but they're like oh, they're concussive explosive things, Just they should hurt me more than they hurt the robots really but who's complaining me, I'm complaining That's, was she working at a broken control panel there <laughs> this is very dedicated I see they are hiding behind that crucifix. Jesus will not save you, robots. <laughs> not even robot Jesus. <laughs> uh, it's like uh, that Jesus in um, AVGN video. I thought we had quite some significant balls to actually do that. To sort of not really make fun, but kind of make fun of Jesus in, uh, in a very Christian country. <laughs> you know, with his... I mean, but then again, he did the Bible games, so it doesn't really give him a hard time. It just kind of just makes him. It just it's just like everything else to him. It's all just popular culture to be mocked, but that's good. Oh God, <laughs> I don't want to go up there. But it looks like I've got eight credits. That's pretty good. This game gives you a decent opportunity to. Uh, oh God, look at them clustering. <laughs> a decent opportunity to to play the game, even if you keep dying. Let's use another bomb. I want to see them all die at once. Boom! Come on! Oh, I'm out of bombs! I'm so stupid! I walked right into them without any bombs. Where am I? Oh, I'm right in the middle of them. Just shoot everyone! <laughs> Look at this! Oh. Damn it! I can't even see what I'm doing, but I'm killing them. There. Alright, I'm just going to go up this ladder again. Oh! Shouldn't have walked on that, obviously. Ah! Run away! It's the only solution. There! Stop banging those computers! In, in, in time to the music. It's very, uh. Oh, it looks like I shot him! I'm sorry, guy. Oh, but he's okay. <laughs> looks like these, these weapons I use aren't very effective against humans, uh, but very effective against robots. So yeah, they, uh, I'm supposed to rescue this woman called Sarah Bellum. Get it? Sarah Bellum. It's very funny. Oh, look at that. All these women too, apparently. I hope I have some kind of mobile transporter and I'm not just disintegrating these people. <laughs> but the uh, the Sarah Bellum joke, I heard that before on the um, podcast and radio show um, of the SETI Institute, which is the 
Oh, I got flattened. <laughs> Which is the search for extraterrestrial uh, people. And uh, they use that joke um, in their brains on vacation uh, segment. It's a great podcast. Uh, the podcast was called Are We Alone? But they changed it to uh, uh, Big Picture Science. Because it's not just about... They just do. It's just a general science podcast. It's very well made, but again, I'm talking about things that have nothing to do with the game. It's just because they said cerebellum. Yeah. What's this? Portomatic. Oh my god! I've been squeezed into a tube. Oh, look at all these women I've acquired. <laughs> and that guy had a very cheesy grin. Steer the cyber sled through the canal mazes. All right. Oh, I see. Right. Oh, okay. I've got a time limit. Oh! It's, it's a maze, of course. I don't like mazes that much. They're not that amazing. Mm, that's a really poor joke. I can't really apologise for that. Oh! Uh, oh, God, come on. Oh, I made it. Oh, I thought I hadn't made it. You are awarded one brick of life. Aha. So... Oh, I see, that's where I choose which level to go to, even though it looks like they're all the same. Wait, ah! Get off! Bang! Bang again! Oh, I killed the guy! Did you see that? I bombed him, which is weird, because I used that bomb on me, like, it's right on my face, and I don't die, but... Oh, oh it's the wall. And, uh, it doesn't kill him, but... Now, yeah, be careful here. Can I shoot that container and not kill her? I do love that. Yeah, I keep saying that. The musical shooting. Okay. Let's see if I can make it through. Ah! It's, 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 it's too difficult. <laughs> there. It's better. So, this is quite a fun little game. And uh, I think I've said all, all I can about it, and quite a lot about stuff that has nothing to do with the game. So. And it looks like with seven more credits, I'm in no danger of dying soon. Ooh, question marks. What they? Oh! Something in it, and it... Is it too... Oh, God, look at the jumping guy. You there. Stop that. Yay! Okay. I'm going to leave it there. This is, uh, this is fun. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Go to tinyurl.com slash jimplays to see categorized lists of all my videos.